Welcome to Al May. We are here to share tech knowledge with you. Let's get our journey started. Today, we are going to show you how to use Windows Server migration tools and an easier alternative to share files between servers. We have two parts in this video. Part one: How to use Windows Server migration tools. Part two: Easier alternative to Windows Server migration tools. For many companies, transferring workloads from one server to another is a common occurrence. Many methods and tools can be used to transfer files from server to server. The most common one is Windows Server Migration Tools. We can use this utility to migrate operating system settings and other data from one server to another. Next, I'm going to show you how to use Windows Server Migration Tools. Before using the building tools, we have to make some preparations. The whole process can be complicated. It's highly recommended to click the link in the description below to see the details. After all the preparations, you can begin to use building tools now. If you want to export the local users and groups from the source server, you can follow these steps. Click Server Manager on the source server. And tools subsequently. Then, click Windows Server Migration Tools to open it. Run the following command. If you want to import the local users and groups to the target server, you can refer to these steps. Open Windows Server Migration Tools on the destination server. Run the following command. As you can see, all the Windows Server Migration Tools can help users transfer data. The operating steps are complex, especially for some non-technical people. If you think this utility is difficult to operate, You'd better use an alternative. Now let's take a look at this alternative. Alme Backup Server is a reliable alternative for Windows Server migration tools. It has a practical feature called File Sync that allows you to synchronize files between Windows servers easily and safely. Just Google Alme Backup Server, download and install it. Run Alme Backup. And come to its interface. Click Basic Sync under Sync tab. The task name can be modified by your needs. Click Add Folder to select the folder you want to share. Click the inverted triangle and select the network location. Then Click Add Network Location and type Network Path. Username, Password to add Destination Path. To continuously sync files, click Schedule and select one or more settings. After all finish, click Start Sync. After a short wait, it will be finished. See, it's as easy as pie. If you find Windows Server migration tools are difficult for you, you can turn to the best alternative, Alme Backup Server. This professional software enables you to transfer files from one server to another easily. The whole process of using Windows Server migration tools and the recommendation of an easier alternative are all presented in this video. Hope you can get what you need. After watching, want to know more about Alme? Looking for more tech knowledge? Just subscribe us and leave comments. We are here to help you with any questions.